So that announcement was made um, just to reinforce our firm commitment to the nation of Nigeria um, around partnering with the nation state to really transforming this great country um, into its true potential and accelerating digital transformation. Now, let me make clear that is, that equates to seven seven fifty million dollars a year. In the most turbulent times in Nigeria, in the last eight years, turbulent economic times in the last eight years, we never eased up on our investments. We've been investing in that range consistently for the last eight years. So this is a continuation of that program. And we did so. Why? Because we firmly believe in the potential of the Nigerian economy and the Nigerian people. So we've been at the forefront of technology and every other investment proposition to ensure that we, together with Nigeria, work this journey to greatness that um, its promise holds. So, some, I guess it's, it's a, in a way of saying you are betting big on Nigeria. In another way, um, what we are saying is Nigeria is home. We have, don't have anywhere else to bet on because this is home, right? Um, the meeting we had with His Excellency the President, uh, Asiwaji Balatinubu, was very reassuring. Um, and I think it's a consistent message it's been sending to the, to the um, to corporate world. Um, one is creating an enabling business environment. Two is reducing bottlenecks, addressing issues like, issues like multiple taxation. Three is digi seeing digitization as a key lever for the transformation um, of this economy. Um, and those are the messages really um, that he gave us. And we think if you do that and allow the free flow of capital um, through the right foreign exchange policy and consistent streamlined regulation, the private sector is going to thrive. Our message, conversely, was that we are more than just a private operator in this economy. We are a partner with the nation state. If Nigeria as a country doesn't prosper, MTN as a company doesn't prosper. So we are looking for ways where what we do and what the government does intersect and really helps to accelerate the transformation of the economy and GDP growth.